So obviously we are playing Storm Drung Peak. And where is <clears throat> Okay, notes. Latest version of Turn One Two da, 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 da. Okay. Known bugs. Okay. All right. Let's go with the uh, story. I'm just reading up on stuff to make sure that it's fine. All right, so story. I just returned from fencing the last of the loot from the mansion job <clears throat> I pulled a couple of weeks ago when I noticed a letter on my doormat. It was from an old flame of mine, Vivian. I hadn't seen her in years since we uh, haven't seen her in years since we parted on less uh, less than amicable terms. Dear Garrett, it has been many long years since our last encounter. Yet it does not seem strange to think of you now. I hope that you uh, have not forgotten me, or the nights we spent together. I write to you now in great peril, and I pray to you, uh, pray that you will put aside any ill feelings and come to my aid. Some months ago, I became engaged to Sir Alexander Alexander Hor uh, Horigon, yeah, Horigon, the commander of the <clears throat> of the city navy. I thought my dreams had come true when I came to stay at the castle at Sturmjong Island, but if I had known then what I know now, I would have refused his advances. <laughs> Alexander has fallen into madness. A great obsession has overwhelmed him, and the cause of it is the discovery of the long-hidden treasure of the captain, William Sturmjong, the ferocious pirate who originally built the fortress here at Sturmjong Peak. It has stripped my fiancé of his sanity driving him to paranoia, obsession, and dark moods, and I fear for my life. I wish only to get away from here, and I know you have the skills and, and contacts to help me escape uh, to where you can never find me. <clears throat> Please, if you ever cared for me at all, help me now. I will wait for you at the inn near the docks, the blasted trout. Find me in room one, Vivian Swift. I wish I could say I was tempted only by the lure of pirate treasure, but that would be a lie. I couldn't just leave her to uh, her to her fate. Maybe I'm not such a cold-hearted bastard after all. Huh? God, it's so fucking bright on my fucking eyes, dude. Right. Let me know if it's too loud. I'm probably gonna turn it down a little bit. I feel like it is a little bit loud right now. Every time I start this version up, it's fucking loud. Yeah, more. Returning to your apartment, you find a letter waiting for you. Garrett's apartment. Wait, did I not click? Okay. I thought I could. I'm tired. I'm really tired. I feel like. Yeah, I don't know. I'll be fine. It's fine. It's just a lot of stress the past week because of the mice. Well, this is cute. Ugh. All right. I had just returned from fencing the I don't know why the audio is so last of the loot from the mansion job I pulled a couple of weeks ago when I noticed a letter on my doormat. It was from an old flame of mine, Vivianne. I hadn't seen her in years since we parted on less than amicable terms. Why did I read it? He's reading it for me. We already read this shit, so we're not reading it again. I feel like the fucking... It's fine. The uses of and properties of elemental crystals geared sloop? Uh, Gerard sloop, Jesus Christ. That's how much I can't... <laughs> you say I can't read, but now it's more so than not. Practical modern security for the gentry. Thomas Dampier. Lost temples and treasures. Sir Reginald Pike, explorer. The magical fauna of the Essa Peak Peaks, Miranda Flitwick, naturalist. <clears throat> Good Emperors, a history of the ancient Southlands, William Gallic. <clears throat> A 
and then we read the note, I guess. We already read this. Not I wish I could say I was tempted only by the lure of pirate treasure, but that would be a lie. I couldn't just leave her to her fate. Maybe I'm not such a cold-hearted bastard after all. Of course he is. Wow, that was easy. Okay, we're done. GG, guys. Alright, so difficulty expert. <clears throat> Damp atmosphere. I don't know how many levels there are to this. I'm assuming just two. After a short voyage, you've arrived at Stormdrung Island. Your letter from Vivian asks you to meet her in room one of the local inn, the Blasted Trout. Go there first and find out why she needs your help. You overheard a couple of sailors on the boat uh, over here talking about a rich nobleman staying at the inn. Make sure he leaves slightly less rich. The dockside warehouse... Uh, <clears throat> the dockside warehouse caught your eye as you were walking down the gangplank. Break in and see what precious cargo you can find. The villagers and watchmen don't have any pr uh, reason to be suspicious of you. Don't get caught breaking anywhere you shouldn't be or attacking anyone. Alright. <clears throat> I have nothing on me, by the way. The watch should leave me alone. As long as nobody sees me breaking and entering, that is. I'm assuming... <laughs> is someone there? Hey! Apparently, dumbass hurt me. <laughs> Someone there? Hey. Bro, what the fuck, dude? What kind of horseshit is this? Like, is it because is it because the guards there? chance I get. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Uh, yeah, that rain from outside. These old buildings make too much noise. Fantastic. Fuck, was that it? Steal the valuables from the noble instinct at the- Jesus uh, Christ, that was easy. Hmm. Give me the key. Give me the key. Hmm, I'm starting to see things. Yeah. I'd better get some rest. Good idea, get some sleep, bud. Okay, that was it in here? I feel like I went a really mm. awkward mm. route, to be honest. Like a really fucking awkward route. Like, that's like unusual for me to take that route. Like, routes like that, I feel like. <clears throat> so as far as I remember, I've never played this. So, out of all the missions that I have that I'm playing, which I'm almost done with, that are installed on my computer, obviously, there's, well, I think, I remember playing that, not yet. Garrett, I hope to meet you in person, but alas, recent developments have made it impossible to, for me to leave the castle. My fiancé Alex invited an archaeologist, Isaac Grint, to help him study the treasure, but it seems the lure of riches has consumed both men. <coughs> 
Gren has controlled part of the castle, and there is much fighting. Please visit Sergeant Pavid of the Village Watch. He is a close friend of mine and will be most willing to help you get into the castle. Go and see him in his office. He will know what to do. It may also be necessary to track down three valuable crystals hidden here on the island by the pirates William Sturmdrung. They are rumored to have power of their own. Please hurry, for I don't know how much longer it will be before madness and greed totally consume everyone uh, in this forsaken place. I love Vivian Swift. Well, this complicates things. I'd better see this pavid guy. <clears throat> okay, so that's the crystals. Go see Pavid. And yeah. <clears throat> oh. We should be fine here, right? down here real quick. I wanted to take a really funny route, but I'll go down here instead. Pure rye. Smells like old meat. Fuck you. The fuck was that? I got a banana! Those are really good missions. Malazars and Raven's Reach were both really good. Oh, I got a banana! That server feels good too. Yeah, that one was good. I remember that one. You guys hear that? Do you notice a difference from here to here? The sound. That's actually pretty impressive, actually. Jesus. That's actually pretty impressive. And you can still hear it in here. Or maybe that's not... I don't know, maybe not. You can definitely hear, obviously, the regular rain, and then the rain here. I don't know if you can hear it in here, though. Maybe it's just me. I'm not sure if that's rain hitting. Or if that's, like, fucking something that's... I don't know. Uh, where I'm gonna go upstairs. <clears throat> yeah, I was actually gonna crazy. I think it's the first mission that... That has to be rain, right? That is rain, right? I'm assuming that is rain. Yeah, that has to be, I guess. <clears throat> Nuts. There's like fucking corpse under there. It's so random, wine cellar off limits to guess of the end. Oh, it's not a booba statue. That's too bad. My mouse pad feels so fucking weird right now, to be honest. <clears throat> right, fuck it. Oh no, I wanted to do this. Whoops. Excuse me, sir. Main customer coming through. sure I'm not supposed to be up here. Yeah. I was not supposed to be up there. The water drops are pretty cool too. Off the side of the house and the roof and stuff. I usually don't see that a lot. 
There was one mission I saw that plus. Okay. What's that? <laughs> Dude, I swear to God. <clears throat> Who's there? Hello? with a banana? Apparently not. Mm -hmm. oh. Diary, 1st of September. No sooner had I finished the new uh, ceremonial sword for the commander than all his fighting start... <clears throat> Hold on. No sooner had I finished the new ceremonial sword for the commander than all this fighting starts in the castle. The builder only knows what's going on up there. <clears throat> Here we go. Just making sure I unmuted myself. Um, all I know is that unless it all gets sorted out soon, I'm not getting paid. Luckily, I still have that nugget I smelt uh, from the ore <clears throat> Jameson sent. The fool had no idea of the value of his land. Maybe I should move to the city, open a jeweler's with this startup capital so thoughtfully <laughs> provided by my imbec <laughs> imbecilic supplier. What a douchebag. With a bit of luck, I'll have some more supplies on tomorrow's boat, so at least I won't be twiddling my thumbs if the situation in the castle doesn't get resolved. <laughs> Who's there? Hello? <clears throat> yeah, come back. Hello? Yeah, I'm fucked. I'll read the book, though, at the very least. Because I, after that one mission of me reading stuff and all that crap, I literally do not trust this fucking, like, game anymore. Ah. Fuck. Well, there's nothing over there, which is fine. I can't clack anywhere near these houses or I'm gonna get fucking screwed. <laughs> the Drowned Goddess, Chapter 9, The Final Days. The goddess Mohana's rage was unparalleled. Winds howled and storms racked the island, uh, island nation. Rain flooded the streets and the very earth shook. The ground split and the sea leapt up to claw at the land. <clears throat> Only the temple remained untouched. The high priest knew that Mohana's anger would never be sated, and with one, uh, with one last desperate act, the priests combined all their might and gave their lives to perform one last act of magic. They trapped the goddess within the flooded depths of her own temple and turned her corporeal uh, form to stone their own magic burning them to death in the process. Mohana's cries of rage became muted and futile, and the unquiet ocean did rest once more. But the damage was too great, and the city slipped beneath the waves and sank, its proud history lost forever to the reclaiming sea. Only the uh, temple remained standing, forever guarding the horrifying secret within. <coughs> Interesting. Sounds fun. Huh. <sighs> oh, 
shit. Alright, so I'm supposed to get lockpicks at some point. Dearest Raymond, when you can visit the city, uh, when can you visit the city again? My heart yearns for you. It is so cold and lonely without you. I would so dearly wish to come away with you to your wonderful little island. It sounds so exciting and beautiful. Alas, my contract holds me here for another year, my darling. That is, unless I <clears throat> were to be married. <laughs> that would invalidate my contract, and we could be together forever. I eagerly await your reply. Your, uh, your beloved Jessica. Interesting. Very interesting. In the shadow there. Hmm. I see that. All right, so that's kind of cool. I go down here now. <coughs> Wait, what? Fucks the door. Other side? Mm. Bananas? Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I thought this was fucking marble at first. I was with the fucking. Second September, another ship due on the morrow. After morn has broke, I uh, after morn has broke as I hear it, I'll be one of the. I'll be. Jeez, I'm so tired. I'll be the one has has. I'll be the one as has to unload the cargo, and make no mistake. Old Sam never complains. Old Sam can do it. Filthy taffers, everyone. But old Sam's back won't last. Old Sam be frail and failing. What do they do when old Sam wends his merry way to the uh, sacred grove and leaves them short? Why, they'll hire a lad to take over. Forget old Sam ever was born. Tis the way of things. Old Sam, nothing ever changes. It's sad as fuck. <clears throat> yeah, it's true, though, but it's sad. <clears throat> specific amount of gold. I kind of like that idea because then I don't really, you can do whatever you want to do at that point. I obviously love exploring everything. So it's Fuck you, ladder. What's that? Ah. Uh. Is someone there? For the banana. I'm risking my life for a banana. What's this guy doing? Stand still. Hmm. 
Don't hurt me. Shit. <sighs> Help! There's nothing up there. I'm wasting my time. Wasting my fucking time. <clears throat> See if construction keep out. Okay. All right. Um. We might have to go to the. We might have to go to the sergeant. Is someone there? That noise. Takings have been worrying low these days. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Takings have been worrying low these last few weeks. I nearly fainted when Joran won big last night. Luckily, the fool took his winnings upstairs and returned them all through the affections of pretty young Rosie. Jesus Christ, pretty young Rosie. His wife will no doubt be banging the door down soon. There's a new ship. Sh <laughs> there's a new ship should be coming in the morning. So hopefully a few drunken sailors can be persuaded to come and part with a little cash. I'll send Tommy round to the inn to advertise later tonight. I really hope they stop bickering and sort uh, blah, and sort out their problems in the castle. This blockade, <clears throat> this blockade is stopping the guards coming down to blow their wages, and that's near half my profits most weeks. This job's getting more stressful by the day. Maybe Madame Felicity can calm my nerves. God damn it. Oh, sorry. More to worry about now, bud. What's that? That was weird. Yeah, I think I would remember playing something like this. Just from the uniqueness of the rain sounds. <clears throat> Alright, so... I've been... Here. It's the end.
that with us. I don't know what caught me, but I'm assuming it was the guard. Is Benny? that you, Kevl? You, you stay away. Oh, she's looking straight at me. I thought she was looking the other way. It's almost hard to hear because of the rain, which is kind of funny, and actually kind of cool. Because if I can't really hear, it keeps me on edge on, is she going to come up or not, right? Chapter 6. Wait, what book was this? Or just, okay. Ah, uh, you're a busty wench and no... Ah, <laughs> uh, you're a busty wench and no mistake, said the pirate. All coarse manners and an uncouth nature. I rather think you should keep uh, such opinions to yourself," said uh, Amelia. Her face felt hot at the attentions of the <laughs> this is so funny attentions of this lecherous sailor, but the thrill of the danger she was in excited her nonetheless. The pirate smiled and continued with his work, unloading heavy crates from the ship. Sweat glistened from his bare, muscled arms. And the Hia gasped and looked away. She was all like a quiver with strange, new feelings. Breathing heavily, her <laughs> Oh my god, this is fucking hilarious. I love it. Um, she was all a quiver with strange, new feelings. Breathing heavily, her bosom rose and fell within her constrictive, uh, bodice? I don't know. She became acutely aware of the fabric rubbing uh, rubbing her, not unpleasantly. When she looked up, he was there before her, a wicked glint in his uh, black devilish eyes. His rough sailor's hands gripped her wrist. She gasped involuntarily, but made no effort to resist. And that was it. <laughs> With something, I guess. I'm assuming this doesn't have a next page, as I'm assuming. Unless, and honestly, there has been, there actually hasn't been anything with another page on there. That shouldn't have anything to do with it, I don't think. Hello? Hi. Anyone there? Yes. Dear Miriam, 
I think I should be returning to the city just as soon as I can get a job on one of the trading vessels passing through here. Life on this island is not the exciting adventure I had hoped. Instead, it is a quiet and boring little town with nothing much to do besides hard work. And the weather is quite disagreeable to my sensibilities. <clears throat> it is always hot, even in the winter months. Yet it rains a warm torrent most every day at various unpredictable times. One becomes soaked to the bone and drenched with sweat at the same time. A most unwelcome, sensa unwelcome sensation. Give my love to Prue and the twins. King, uh, kind regards, Philip. <clears throat> Sorry I'm not talking too much, I'm just really tired. So, that's good, because I, I need to get some sleep soon, because the, obviously the exterminator is coming tomorrow. So. <sighs> but yeah, I would say the Cargo IL practice is going really well, I feel like. Because I'm not actually doing runs, so I'm not actually getting pissed off when I, like, you know, lose anything, because I haven't really lost anything. <clears throat> And then on top of that, like, when I did do a run, I actually didn't do that bad. So I, I do like that as well, like, how I just, just, the practice, like, just grind, 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 do the run later. Grind, 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 do the run later. So, and even with TF2, when I, like, I like everything's coming together. And even though I didn't do too great with TF2 today, because I'm just fucking tired. It's the lack of, like, it's not even a lack of sleep, I just, I, I don't know what the fuck it is. Sleeping an odd hour? No, it's been a lack of sleep, too. Can't say that. Well, not... Last night was fine, I guess. Oh, oh shit. Oh, actually, no, we're fine here. There's never any birds around anymore. Used to be birds. Singing Watch in the Sergeant. morning. <laughs> you up. Singing at night, looking for girl birds to meet up with. Just don't hear them no more. Oh, that's cute. I like that. Eight p.m. Nothing to report. Nine p.m. Nothing to report. Ten p.m. Thought I heard a strange noise. Turned out to be rats. Oh Jesus! I don't want to hear anything about rats or mice. <laughs> Eleven p.m. Nothing to report. Twelve p.m. Nothing to report. One a.m. Heard another strange noise. It was one of them grubbers again. <laughs> Two to four a.m. Nothing to report. Five a.m. Nothing to report, don't know why I'm even bothering, no one's breaking the law around here. The only trouble is up at the castle, and we can't even get in there. It's also been empty for weeks, I'm going to stretch my legs for a while. These are pretty clean cells. There's not even bedding in here. Oh. Speaking of which... Castle gate mechanism key. R. When you get the castle keys, bring them down to me at the docks. I don't know who this Grint guy is, but he's paying well for them. If you get nabbed by the watch, just act drunk and they should let you out in a day or so. They can't hang you for trespassing, especially not if they think you're just a foolish drunkard B. <clears throat> I'm not sure if I did this out of order or not. I'm assuming I can get my lockpicks, I just don't know where. Oh. So this mission came out in 2013. For 2013, honestly, I think the most unique thing about the mission is literally... <coughs> should be fine over here, right? <laughs> you must be Garrett! Sergeant Pavin said to let you help yourself from the armory here. Hmm. I'd better think carefully about what equipment to take. I think I'm going to talk to Sergeant What's His Nuts first. But yeah, the, the sound of the rain is probably the most unique thing I've heard. I don't think any other mission has done that. You, Garrett? Lady Vivian told me to expect you. You can help me get into the castle. What's going on up there? 
Commander Horrigan invited some treasure expert from the city to help him with whatever he's found up there. Problem is, this guy brought a crew of pirates with him and seized control of the castle. No one's been allowed in or out since. I'd better find Vivian quickly, then. How do I get up there? <clears throat> Unless you can fly, the only way is the main elevator. You'll have to hide among the supplies and wait for them to send them up. Not ideal, but it'll have to do, I suppose. I just hope Vivian's alive when I find her. Uh, I hope so, too. Whatever that treasure is, it can't be worth all this bloodshed. Don't worry. I'm sure I can take it off their hands. Oh, and one more thing. Take the key from my desk. It unlocks the armory upstairs. Help yourself to whatever weapons or tools you need. Obviously. Thanks. I'm sure Vivian will appreciate you helping me like this. So we went to the room. Having the sergeant in charge of the village watch station. We're here to help you get to the castle, pay him a visit, and see what he knows. Take the key from Sergeant Pavit's desk and retrieve some equipment from the watch armory. Vivi is correct. The original inhabitants of Stormdark Peak, Captain William Stormdark, hit three valuable Kriyaki crystals. Still the loot in the dockside warehouse. According to Sergeant Pavit, the only way in the castle is via the, via the main elevator. Once your other objectives are done, break into the castle and find a place to hide. Oh, there's another one here. Interesting. September 2nd. The situation has grown worse in the castle. We have not heard anything in days. I fear for the lives of those trapped inside. We have managed to bargain for the supplies with the thugs guarding the castle entrance, and they have promised to release some of their hostages. Um, it is Lady Vivian I fear for. If the commander finds out she is planning to escape, it will be the worst for her now, I am sure. He has surely lost his mind agreed. This treasure he has found will be the ruin of us all. I only hope that salvation will arrive in the form of this Garrett fellow. Her letter said he was a skilled <clears throat> infiltrator. Why, thank you, sir. You must be Garrett. Yep. Sergeant Pavin said to let you help yourself from the armory here. Hmm. I'd better think carefully about what equipment to take. <clears throat> Fuck a sword. Where's the blackjack? Oh. Fuck those, actually. Just in case. Invor inventory of chests. That's actually kind of cool. So we get to choose one. So in this in this one, it's one sword, sharp, six, 62 arrows. Jesus Christ. Sharp. Four crystal arrows, water arrows. Uh, explosive. <laughs> explosive two arrows, deployable rope. Three. Oh, never mind. Okay, I understand. Now there's just nothing between that. So, yeah. So, explosive, uh, two arrows, deployable rope, and then three clockwork mines. Explosive, that's part of two vials. Flash powder, two vials, restore potion, lock picks, one pair, confiscated. One letter kosh studded. Four arrows, water arrows. Crystalline earth arrow. Clockwork sound emitters, crystal and arrow, again more air. Noxious two arrows, deployable rope. I think this is probably the best one. Let's read this one. One sword sarp, eight crystal and arrows, water, three crystal and arrows, earthen, two arrows, deployable rope. Four mechanists, remote eyes, two vials, haste potion, one vial, vanishing potion, lock picks, one pair. I think this one, because this has the black shack in it. Yeah. That's actually really fucking cool. You can actually do that. I like that. It's basically giving you an option of what to do there. Fuck. Well, 
like, the option is actually really cool. And I'm assuming that you can't choose the other ones after, right? I don't have the key anymore. Yeah, that's really cool. I like that a lot. I like that. This way. Now they know I can slide and clip through doors and do all that. I'm kind of going to do that, obviously. Only if the ma only if the mission's bad venture. Only if it's a soldier mission will do that. Only, 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 only. <clears throat> Dedicated to the memory of Commander James Galloway, naval hero, scourge of piracy, and the liberator of Storm Drung Peak. Amazing. There was like two things I needed to do. There's two chests I need to open. Ah, uh, where the fuck was it? There was at least one chest. You feel insecure? Yeah. I mean, that was the only one that had the uh, that had it too. Was that one? So I obviously was gonna choose that. I don't give a fuck about anything else, honestly. It's nice to have the water arrows and the moss arrows. I would say rope arrows is nice too. Because the rope arrows are kind of not necessary, but they're fucking pretty crucial. So, yeah. Oh, there was in here. But I, I like that. That was the only one, though. The second chest was the only one. Hmm. Thought I saw something. Mm hmm. Might be a fucking. What was that one fucking fan mission? Mm -hmm. Fucking. Oh, Deceptive Scepter. Mm -hmm. So you basically have to go some on this mission. Mr. Oh dear. Someone actually brought that up. I think it was Brad brought that up recently. About playing uh, A Servant's Life. I actually remember playing some of that. The only reason why I remember playing it is because like I was shitting everywhere and you can eat a shit. You can pick it up and eat it. At first I was like, what is this? And I picked it up and I'm like, oh, it's a shit. And then like, I ate it. I'm like, what the fuck? So as far as I know, I think that was it when it came to chests being opened. There might be one more, but I doubt it. There's nobody in here, it's some bandits or make as much fucking noise as we want. As far as I know. I'm not sure if I was actually not allowed to do that or use a rope or whatever. Being the account of Captain William Sturmdrong, September 25th, 1463. My treacherous brethren have turned against me, my ship and the respect of my men stolen by my imprudent first mate James. The vagabonds seek to rob me of my hoard, but they shall not find but they shall find themselves more most aggrieved at the seal, uh, at the seals I have placed upon the vault. The great goddess Mohana has always granted me fair winds, and my golden offering shall remain her, uh, here in her temple. I must hide the crystals so that none may defy my lady and remove the treasure. <coughs> okay, so we gotta find this. Not quite sure what I'm looking for with those, but we'll find out. Oh, that opened because that opened. Whoops. Alright. Let me go hard save real quick. Oh, 
Which one? This one or the fucking, uh, the servant's life one? Alright, so I gotta do something there. That might be an exit? That can't be an exit. It's definitely not an exit. Do I want to come back here, or do I want to do this now, that's the thing. I might as well do it now. Try to. The thing is, is, um... I thought there was one more chest I had to open. But I wasn't sure. Apologize for all the yawning, I am really tired. But I want to at least play this for like an hour. I'd assume I have to be in here. Huh. Like, unless that's an exit. Fuck, I just soft locked. No, we're good. Okay. I thought since the other one was far away, I thought that one would be far away too. So this is probably one of them. Crystals, I'm assuming? Holy hell. This must be pretty valuable for Captain Strumdrag. Okay. Wait, did I... What do you... Wow, really? Okay. To hide it so well. Did you see Stormdrong? Isn't it Stormdrong? I knew it, it was in here, it was the fucking wine cellar. That was the other one. It's the name of the romanticism period in literature in German. <gasps> Got it, yeah. It sounded German. I'm assuming, st well, storm is st storm, I'm assuming. I'm not sure what drunk is. There's actually a German song, I think. Well, it's like a German band, but they speak English too. I forgot what the band name was, but it's called Storm und Drang. Stomp or Chunk. I like that bottle, that's actually pretty sick. Okay, nothing. Oh, cute.
force. Okay, so storm force. How can I not take any of this? You've got to be fucking shitting me. I'm in a I'm in a wine cellar, and I cannot take one measly bottle of wine down here. Damn, that sucks. Get fucked, me, I guess, huh? Obviously, there's a way back here. How to get there? Uh, click everywhere. Really fast. So you do it. Yeah, I don't know if there's. There has to be a way over there. I'm assuming that moves? Oh, never mind. It just shows me where the ladder is, which is like kind of in that direction. Then he knows the secret entrance for sure. Yeah, fuck, yeah, he does. The drunken bastard knows all the fucking entrances for all alcohol places. What was that at? area. We'll go over there next along. I want to make sure I've gotten everything thoroughly checked over here before going anywhere else. Because that's how I like doing things. <laughs> I think we could do. <sighs> yeah, I think we're good. What's crazy is this fan mission is vaguely familiar for some reason. So I might have played a little bit of it, but honestly, I, I thought I would have realized the sound of the fucking whatchamacallit. I can't think right now. The sound of the, um... Listen to this. There's new water, there's new rain sound. Gotta go. All right, for sure. Take care. Mantle, forgotten roots. Good luck with your apartment as well. Thank you. Appreciate that. Yeah, I'll be fine. So, thank you. Appreciate it. Right, we need to go in here. Finn's Diary, Thursday 2nd. Business has been slow, but I'm doing well enough to see it floats. If I could only find a way to sabotage the con uh, conniving son of a uh, baboon jack next door. Every time I legit legitimately locate a good fishing area, that stinking fat git comes along and cheats me out of <laughs> cheats me out of it by fishing the area dry. I have a good mind to knock some manners into that thick head of his. Perhaps with a good frozen solid haddock. This does. That's so cute. Yeah, this is kind of familiar. <laughs> this is somewhat familiar, I feel like. <laughs> I, I think I just fucked myself. Crap. 
That's a different side, I think. Uh, we'll go there after. Uh, um, ah! Safest places underneath uh, spiral staircases. Fisherman Jack's Diary, Thursday 2nd. That scheming bastard Finn next door thinks he can outwit me. Always cheating me out of my rightful fishing and stealing all the best fish for himself before I even get out to the best fishing areas. Business is okay. <laughs> I don't even understand this. <laughs> Business is okay, but it would be much better if I could just be rid of that entrail eating cur. Perhaps I could poison some fish heads and jam them in his big stupid mouth. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. It sounds like, I don't know what the hell's going on, honestly. It sounds like this guy's being a dickhead. They're both being dickheads, but this, this guy's being more of a dickhead. Fuck, that was a bad idea. Like I said, there was one fan mission I played uh, somewhat recently, and I had to read three pieces of, like, whatever evidence. I don't know what it was. And then the next thing triggered, so, like, now I get fucking paranoid about that. Sick, actually. Pretty good. I like it. Well, that's cute. Sun, moon. I think we're done. I think we're done. Pretty sure we're done here. Oh, hello. Apparently not. I got three bananas. I win. Those here is not home right now. They're outside, fucking off. No, Booba statue. God damn it. Chief Engineer's Log, September 2nd. These mechanical contraptions were not built for the uh, humid weather and unpredictable rainstorms down here. 
The hammers think they're so great, but the tropical conditions play havoc with the electrics. I think I fixed up the generators so the streetlights won't go out again, but I'll be buggered if uh, if I'm back to fix it uh, again today. I'm off to see Wendy down the do uh, down the docks, get plastered, and try to slip my hand up her skirt. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Power station electric lighting installed this fifth day in March 1487 by the noble order of the hammer. The builder's word shall be as a beacon in the dark. Okay, we're done. We need to go to the docks though. Is there a map? Oh fuck. Okay, so yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, we've been basically everywhere except for the docks. Um, and this building right here. The gallows are right here. So, over here. No fucking way, dude. I've been here. Yeah, let's do it here. has to just be this, this here. Is that even anything though? I was made a big fucky wucky. Okay, that leads to that side. Okay, so we'll go northwest next. We have the castle thing, we'll go there, but I'm not sure if it means I haven't been here or not. I'm not sure what this means actually. Call me old meat. Square up, bitch. Square up, bitch. <coughs> Actually, did I even do that? No, it doesn't. <coughs> I will not do that. <coughs> you want to call me old meat? He's getting knocked out. There's some back over there. Let me go this way. Is that one? Oh. Stop it. Garrett, I swear to fucking Christ. Get out of here. Uh-oh. Okay, good. <laughs> That's a little worrisome there. So, the warehouse is here. And then the 
docks are right next to it. Right, I'm gonna play for a tad bit longer, but I wanna try to get some sleep because I'm not gonna get much sleep tonight because I gotta wake up hella early and my sleep's been dog. Like just the time I've been sleeping has mostly been shit. But I've been stressed out, so it, it's been harder. To, like usually getting like my only problem like long term is like getting to sleep at a decent time. Um, other than that, like. Staying asleep is usually not a problem, usually. Delivery is 2nd September. Two crates unspecified, unspecif yeah, unspecified ore delivered to blacksmith. 14 crates grain, treated meats, delicacies delivered to castle. Antiques urn, tapestry, ceremony, uh, ceremonial mask for, del uh, for delivery to the castle for Commander Horrigan's collection. Two barrels grog delivered to the blasted trout. One letter delivered to Mr. Raymond Points. Outgoings. Three letters. City post office. Uh, four crates wood delivered to Randall Carpentry Short Streets. One crate assorted bench. Uh, bleh, assorted beach. Assorted beach stones delivered to Doctor W Kingsley research purposes. Truman, don't send that. Uh, don't send the antiques. Uh, oh no no. Just, uh, don't send the antiquity. Uh, antiquities, antiquities, yeah, antiquities. Up with the food. We'll wait till the situation in the castle calms down a bit before entrusting priceless artifacts to a bunch of thugs. Good idea. Yeah. I'm glad I'm tired right now. Honestly, I didn't think I was gonna be tired. Hello? Anyone there? Fuck. So I'm kind of glad I'm very tired. Well, well I'm pretty there's tired. There's no one here now. <laughs> Who's that? And I know once Please this all gets taken care of, I'll be fine. Hmm. I should be better tomorrow with all this crap going down. But I'll... I should have worked out a third time this week and I didn't. I, just did... I need to do squat next though. It's like right fucking there. So I think we're going to end up just probably, I think there's one more mission, and if there is, we'll finish this up, do that. If there's not, and there's extra objectives, we'll just stop. Putting the certain path in the Louis Ignace was going to make it. Okay. So, what I'm seeing, oh, we haven't gone to the docks yet. I want to go to the docks. I want to see huh? the... Hello? Shit. Anyone there? Oh, he's too dumb to fucking hear me. Where are the docks, though? Hi. It was nothing. What? It was nothing. I want to see the fucking docks. That's fucking rude. Can I see the docks or not? Oh, we're gonna see the fucking docks. We're gonna see the docks. Hmm. Thought I saw some. <clears throat> Fuck. <laughs> Come on, asshole. Who's there? Hello? Fuck, oh. I'm gonna knock this idiot out. Just rats again. <clears throat> Shut up with that. We're gonna see the goddamn docks. Dumbass. Who's that? <gasps> ah, the beautiful docks. Wait a second. Uh oh. 
Cheaters never prosper, that's what that teaches you. Honestly though, that's really nice. Actually, can I... <gasps> so from there, fuck. The hell are you doing back here, bud? Why is he back here? Can I fall off this? No. You can fall off this side though, right? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go see about the mission ending. We got lucky with the key. There's something about this mission that seems familiar though. I just don't remember. I don't know. The thing is, I don't remember. If anything, I don't remember playing much of it. And I don't remember the rain sounds like being different and shit. I don't know. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Okay. It's the fucking wine cellar. This guy's, uh... What was that noise? Shut up. There's the damn Take up. Hey! Who are you? Alright, he fucking he saw me go into a house. Understandable. I'll show them someday. Someday I'll get over here. Have we gone over here? I feel like I should have remembered. Oh, yes, we have. Just went over here. I want to see what's under that fucking... <laughs> September 2nd, Grunts got me, uh, yeah, Grunts got me and Roth on guard duty down here, where we're more likely to get killed by the damn watch in the village. His money's good, but he's just one of them people you want to smack. Got one of them faces. God damn it. I swear one of these days he'll take his uh, holier than thou attitude and start ragging on about um, expert treasure hunter he is, and I'll just lose it and jam my sword right into his pasty little face. We got to delivery of supplies and food and stuff this morning. Managed to bargain a trade for a couple of hostages. They'd better break through soon and capture some more. The only way we, uh, the only one we got left is that fool who tried being a hero and got himself stabbed up. He ain't gonna last much longer, I'll wager. Okay, I feel like this might actually just go on. I'm gonna stop right here, because I don't want to do too much longer. I'm, I need to get to bed, and I need to get some sleep. So... Here, it's fine. This was fun, though. We will continue this probably tomorrow.